Good morning everyone. Thanks for coming back for day two. As you can see, Ryan is here. He showed up last night about, oh, I think he showed up. What time did you show up, Ryan? About 8.30, 9? Yeah, about 9 o'clock, and uh, we stayed up until probably about, oh, 11.30 last night, and then hit the, hit the hay. Woke up this morning, made some coffee, made some breakfast, some bacon, eggs, had some biscuits with some strawberry jam, jelly, some Smucker's stuff that Ryan bought. Oh, my God. That breakfast was amazing. And uh, now I just need to take a nap, but it's time to start packing up camp do a little KP duty and then I don't know where we're gonna go today I think we may do some exploring around here or we may drive up into the Ozarks and um, stay somewhere there tonight I'm not sure so um, if you didn't watch uh, yesterday's video go watch it first and then come back to this but I'm gonna get this day going it should be a good day. The weather is going to be um, overcast, but um, but it's only going to get up to like low 70s. It's going to be really nice out. The humidity will probably be up a little bit like it was yesterday. It's pretty humid uh, once I got into camp, um, but I slept. Oh, it was so nice. The weather was perfect sleeping, and for me anyways, it was amazing. Um, but yeah, we're going to get this day going, pack up camp, and uh, do the damn thing. So stay with us, and hopefully you enjoy today as much as we are. KP duty. Now I've got to just pack up tent. I'm not going to bore you with that. I don't even know why I bored you with that, but um, once we get packed up, I'll, I'll uh, let you know what we are going to do. So stay with me. stuff packed and we're back out on the trail so we decided we're just gonna stay here in the Washita's do some exploring maybe find a campsite down here to stay at tonight well it's not maybe stay at tonight we're gonna find one and um, hopefully we just find a good one maybe close to some water but we're gonna do some exploring and uh, hopefully it turns out to be a really good day so far like a uh, forecast predicted it's just overcast um, and it's not raining so that's that's good you know obviously I don't want to I don't want it to be raining because then I don't want to have to put up a wet tent and uh, go back home and let it air out so but we're gonna do some exploring so y'all stay with us and uh, hope y'all enjoy today
Okay, you're good on both sides. Come slow, slow. Keep it straight, slow. Your right, your 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 passenger tire may rub on that tree and pull, push you off a little. Keep that line. You're clear. Clear. Got it. Nice. set up and this is this spot that I found last time I was in this area but there were some campers already here so today um, we did a little exploring and tried to find some trails to hit but we just didn't have any luck so we uh, ended up coming to the spot ri you know risking it because we didn't know if anybody's gonna be here and we suspected someone would probably be here with it being on a Saturday and um, but we got lucky and no one was here. Man, check this place out, man. It is so awesome. It is a uh, definitely a really cool campsite. Very secluded. Um, definitely not easy to get to. Definitely going to have to have some kind of high clearance four-wheel drive vehicle. But uh, it is pretty a pretty epic place. Um, it's got these amazing cascades over here beautiful river that flows right next to it it's pretty awesome and you got Coda over here getting her drink on but we uh, ended up getting settled in and now we're just chilling man it is the weather right now is absolutely amazing um, it's a little overcast, not much at all, if any. Um, cool weather, I'd say maybe low 70s. No wind, very light breeze. It's just, <laughs> it is great. I could camp in this kind of weather every time. I mean, this this is like the ideal camping weather for me personally. But we're gonna just hang out for a little bit and just relax. Um, and we'll get dinner going over here a little bit later and then I've got uh, a dessert that I'm gonna make you all stick around and uh, I'll end up showing y'all what we're gonna have for dinner tonight and what kind of dessert we're gonna have so stay tuned okay
About to start cooking some dinner and can you guess what we're gonna have tonight? Schwann's again for cheese penne with prosciutto. The picture doesn't do it justice everyone this thing is bomb but we're about to put it in the oven it says to do for 30 minutes and then take the sheet of film off and do it for another 15 so let's get this bad boy in there Are you gonna fit? Oh, barely. Heck yeah. Okay, 15 minutes. Let's get this going. I've also got some green beans going as well. Green beans and pasta. Nice. So we're sitting around waiting for things to get done in the oven, and this fire keeps throwing out these green flames, and we don't know why but it's pretty cool looking. All right, so we forgot to show you the finishing product of dinner, which it ended up turning out fantastic. But I'm not gonna forget to show you what we have here. We got some dessert going and it is blueberry crisp and it's hot. So we're gonna set that right there and we're gonna top it off with some vanilla ice cream. Hell yeah, this is gonna be great. Oh man. Oh shit. Golly. And it's all to ourselves. No one else, we're not sharing this with anybody. I don't even know why I'm giving Ryan any of this. Okay, Ryan. No, no! <laughs> Ice cream scoop! Ice cream scoop! Come on, bro. You do that? No, you do that after you scoop. Do you not know how to use one of these? No, I never use one of these. No, now you push it. Oh my god, we've got an amateur on board, fellas. Guy doesn't know you doesn't know how to use an ice cream scoop. Oh my god, it's gonna be so good. What an amateur, dude. Well, I'm gonna make mine, and I'm about to get down. But, with that being said, again, I appreciate everybody coming along for this video. This is gonna be the end of it. Um, if you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. Press that like button. And until next time, late is on the Minjay.